So let's move that coffee out of the way. Um, it's basically three different cuts for cigars. So there's the straight cut, which is most common, V cut, which is becoming incredibly popular, and then there's the punch cut, which you do see occasionally, but not very often. So I picked three cigars, basically exactly the same size. So we're going to go through each one. So a trick with a straight cut, like a little guillotine, whether it be double edged or just a single edge, is if you're not sure about how much of the cap you're going to take off, put the cutter on the table and then put the cigar in and just go straight through. And there you go. That should give you a perfect cut. Now, punch cut. Now, this is one you don't see it as often. I think it's just not as popular. This one's in the bottom of one of my cigar stands, so it's really useful. So what you do, take the punch, and you just twist it into the bottom of the cigar. You'll feel it go through the cap. And there you go. What it does is basically create a hole right in the middle of the cigar. So you have the entire cap is still in place, and that should stop the cigar from unraveling. And then we get onto what everybody knows me for probably, which is the old V cup. So for me, I think this is probably bulletproof. If you're worried about damaging your cigar, this is probably the fastest way of doing it and the most accurate way of doing it. It's got a back plate, so you can't go too far. Put the cigar in, and then just one push. And then you're left with one simple deep V cut. What that does is go straight through the middle of the cigar, but still doesn't go past the lip. So you're not down, going further than what the, the cap of the cigar is. That gives you slightly more surface area than the straight cut does. And personally, I think it has a better draw. But that's because the surface area is just that bit bigger, I would say. It does make for a faster smoke, though. I would say in terms of speed, you'd go... V will be fastest, straight cut, and then a punch because it's such a restricted smoke. So there you go. There's the update of my cigar cutting video, which I've been meaning to do for a while. Hope that helps.